Have you ever wondered what it'd be like to be a backstage director at an international fashion show? Hi, I'm Lisa Sim and you're watching WatchMojo.com and today we'll be speaking with Sophie Lanza, backstage director and support to the designers at Montreal Fashion Week. So can you tell me how do you get into the business of being a stylist and then subsequently a backstage director and a support to the designers? I worked in a commercial studio as a coordinator, then went on to you know, being a freelance stylist with representation by Clouté. So I was doing mostly print photography. And honestly, when I started working in the business, fashion shows wasn't really my thing. So I thought as an assistant to stylists who were doing shows, I thought it was like so much work. During Fashion Week, what are the key roles of being a backstage director? Support to the designer, which means uh, we do rehearsal with models, they tell me what they want, what kind of mood their collection is about, what inspired them. I give that info to the models. Models then on stage show us what they can do. Any insecurity, anything that makes them nervous, I'm just there to make sure they're comfortable, they're happy. How does a typical show roll out? Models are here about three hours before the show. So they come in, work on hair and makeup. Then what's crazy is that I see the models for rehearsal about 30 minutes before the show and in that I only have about 10 minutes to rehearse with them. So, you know, the girls are very professional, they know what they're doing, I'm very clear in direction and they give it to me. Tell me what would be your full logistical nightmare of this job. Sometimes, you know, some girls are booked from show to show to show and sometimes show run late and then you're trying to show, start the other one on time. So then you've got maybe some shows, we had six girls that were doing shows back to back so that, that's nerve-wracking. And can you tell me your ultimate runway nightmare? This model from Specs, she fell, I think, three times, and I went out to get her. I couldn't, she, she was like very fragile, and she fell once, she fell twice. This third time, I just went, I just grabbed her. I just got, left the backstage, and I went to get her. I want to thank you, Sophie Lanza, for giving us a little insight for what happens backstage at a Montreal Fashion Week. Thank you. Mm -hmm.